Welcome back to Realistic Fishing. I'm out here this evening to fish with this stupid looking lure. This is one of my new favorites, the Clawless Craw. Look how mangled. This is the body from a crawfish lure. It has a couple legs left, one antenna. It's missing a bunch of legs, both claws, and another antenna. But this, this is what I'm going to start out with. We'll start off fishing it down here in the corner. We got some down trees and stuff. The water has really receded since the last time I was here. Yeah, last time, this swing was underwater, so, you know, it was up a good 15, 20 feet up into the grass. Now it's back at its regular summer pool. Hopefully we can still find a fish. I'm not exactly sure where I'm going to find fish tonight. The lake is really pulled back, so I'm thinking out there in slightly deeper water. We'll just have to see. We're going to have to feel it out. Fish. On the clawless craw. That's a good fight. Yeah. Yeah, not bad. That is why I'm fishing it. I'm going to have to design my own lure pretty soon. That's basically a craw body and one long antenna coming off because they like it. First fish of the night here. We got maybe a pound. Maybe a pound. Tell your friends I said you were a pound. And tell them you were on realistic fishing. Let's let them go. It's kind of muddy. I'm going to have to give them a toss. This is Christian from Michigan City, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Still have my lure. Let's get it fixed up, quote unquote, fixed up. Ha, <laughs> that right there. First fish of the night. Let's keep going. I have a choice to make. Do I go right towards the down trees and the point? Or do I go left over toward the dock and the boat ramp? I think we're going to go this way. We'll make a few more casts, but I think we're going to the right. Yeah, not a bad fish. First one on the clawless craw. It's quickly becoming one of my new favorites. I don't know why. It is so dumb. But I'm catching fish on fish. But I'm catching fish on it. Wow. You see that jump? Here we go. Here we go. That's a better fish. He chomped that. Got him in the roof of the mouth. Luckily not down there in the throat. Nice, nice bass here. This one's even better than that last one. It's got a fat belly. It's been feeding. Oh, great looking bass. Clawless crawl. It ain't no joke. I'm telling you, I'm going to design a lure mold for it. Maybe, maybe it's the next big thing. Let's get a quick picture with this fish. Yeah, here we go. Here we go, second fish of the night on the clawless craw. 
I've been fishing that same dumb craw for, I don't know, two or three episodes now. They like it. Here's the proof. Let's let them go. Still got my lure. It walked up the line in true Texas rig fashion. And we're ready to catch another fish. Look at this thing. The most controversial team to hit USWO wrestling. It's Brian Turner of Booty Call, and you are watching Realistic Fishing. Bounce on over to Brian Turner's VHS Rehab for more of Booty Call. Once again, I'm fishing the $30 baitcaster combo from Walmart. Did you know I had a meme on my Facebook um, about the Ozark Trail $30 combo? It got a million views. I mean, it's probably my most viral post on Facebook ever. And all I was doing was basically bragging about how awesome this $30 combo is. I've been fishing it for like two years. It's caught hundreds of bass still going strong. I had people tell me it was a piece of junk. No $30 combo is ever going to be worth jack shit. Yeah, they're wrong. The proof is in the pudding. I documented all of the footage here on YouTube. This thing has been an absolute beast. Let's go down this way and see if we can get some more bass on the clawless craw. I bounced it off that tree and got a huge backlash. I think it's actually still up in that tree. That was bad. There we go. I think that's it. One more loop. There we go. Horrible calculation on that cast. I casted my lure straight into that tree. It bounced over there and stuck in that tree, and I got a huge backlash. That's not going to discourage me, though. Pretty sure that was a fish. It could have been a branch. Could have been a branch. I mean, there is a big branch in the water right there, but I think it was a fish. I'm Catfish Terry, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Something tapped at it. Fish. Just a little guy. Look at him. Got a Royale with cheese. We got a Royale with cheese. Yeah, check him out. 
I could feel him trying to grab it, and then he finally grabbed it. Quarter pounder here. Come on, let's get another one on this flawless craw. Fish. Oh, he came off. He came off. Let's try this side. Well, that's it for tonight, but I think I proved my point. The bass like a clawless craw. I got three bass tonight, almost four, and I had a few other bites, but the sun went down on me. Should I make a mold for a clawless craw? We'll see. Thanks for watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic.